Hey guys, just got another quick update video for you. Sorry I haven't really had a lot of being able to drive these or anything at the moment, so no videos of that. I'm still currently living in lockdown where I live, but in the last couple of days since uploading the update on Project Stealth, we've had some parts arrive. So this is now completely fixed up. New motor, I've put a fan on their motor as well to try and keep it a bit cooler because I noticed this last Leopard one I had got uh, very warm. The ESCs stay incredibly cool and uh, work incredibly well though, it's just the motor that got a little bit hot on the last one, so I've actually put this one on more optimal gearing, so I've ge geared it down a little bit, put it on a completely stock gearing. Uh, the new spur arrived for this, and we've also locked up all of the diffs on this car, so if I just, you know, have one wheel going, all four of them are turning now. So that was pretty easy. Um, if you want to see me, uh, I'm going to be locking the diffs up on this one here. This Project uh, Fury hasn't been out in a while, so I've been waiting on a lot of parts for this one. They've been a little bit hard to get, but they've all arrived, so I'll be rebuilding this and we'll take it out. I'm probably going to put a brushless system in this one as well and try to just turn this into an all-out basher. I'll just try and break it, I don't really care. But if you want to know how I lock up the diffs, then I'll put it in the video when I'm repairing this one if that's what you want to see or I'll probably just do it anyway because I'm planning on locking it up anyway. So yeah, on this one got the new spur, actually needed to put some new shocks on this one as well, one of them got uh, busted when I crashed it. But yeah, this one's ready to go, uh, I'm just waiting to either A be out of lockdown or B wait for a day that's not raining, it's been pretty crap weather here honestly as well. So sorry again about this just being another update video and being a short video, hopefully I'll be able to get these out and driving very very soon, it's just very unpredictable at the moment thanks to the COVID epidemic that's going on worldwide, but hope we're all staying safe and hey, I'm still able to work on these anyway so it's, you know, silver lining to everything. Alright, well, stay tuned guys, hopefully in the next video we'll actually be getting one of these out and driving them. Again, sorry, I've been in lockdown, haven't been able to, but here's hoping the lockdown will be over in a couple of days. So remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video where hopefully we'll be driving a few cars. I've got a, I've got a few I need to take out for a drive, so hopefully it'll be a good bash sash. Alright, see you then.